Madonna grabbing her pussy. What is going on, Jessica? Are you coming over for noodles? I need fucking God. Or a therapist. Honestly, guys, I'm obnoxious. Happy Madonna Monday. Look at that Madonna Monday playlist. Can I casually brag as I slap my tits and smile? Because, guys, it's Madonna Monday. I'm a mess. Let me be completely honest with you. I have overworked, overexhausted myself. And, like, like guys, like I said, for the first time in my life, I have a full-time job. And I am a disabled bitch. Let's be honest. I am a mess. And I've really been struggling. I have, I like planned on getting a Madonna Monday up last week. I had it filmed and everything, but I wasn't able to get it edited. And I'm not the weirdo that wants to just like throw up bullshit and have it be garbage or, or not, not be properly looked over and edited by your beefy girl, by your beefy bitch. I really want a pussy pop. I'm talking throbbing, aching, smiling cunt. I want to really create the best content that I can. But, but guys, literally as I'm filming this, it is the sixth. This post on the 7th, I'm freaking the fuck out. I have to record, edit, and schedule this video, and it's going to take a lot out of me to do. So we're just going to do something simple. I'm going to react to Express Yourself live at the MTV 1989 MTV Awards. But guys, we're going to be reacting to Express Yourself live at the MTV Awards from 1989. Just a short little video that we're, we're, we're going to have a full body experience with Express Yourself, because it is madonna monday and i know shame on me for being a worthless witch a worthless wart having witch oh nasty foul fool for not getting up last week's video last week's video is probably gonna go up next week i'm sorry that this this is literally being edited right now guys on the 6th october 6th this post on the 7th i'm a train wreck and not the fun kind like a really shitty one here we go though wow What a vibe already! The greatest artist of all time. It's unbelievable. The most historic career in the history of music. Holy shit. Madonna! Come on, girls! Do you believe in love? Because I got something to say about it. And it goes something like this. Don't go for a second best, baby. Put your love to the test. You know, you know, you got to. My crowd! Wow. Oh, the stairs. How cute. What a legend! Make you feel like the History! Make you love you till you can't come down. Don't go for second best, baby. Put your love to the test. You know, you know, you got to make him express how he feels. And baby, then you know your love is real. What a legend! And the short hair, cute. Okay. Very romantic. What happens when you're not in bed? You deserve the best in life. So if the time isn't right, then move on. Second best is never enough. You do much better, baby, on your own. What a goddess! Make him express how it feels And baby, then you know your love is real Express yourself You've got to make it 
express himself. Hey, 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 hey. So if you want it right now, we can show you how. Express what he's got, baby, ready or not. Madonna! It's crazy that that was controversial. Just shaking her hips. Like the history. The boundaries and walls this woman broke down. It's amazing. It's so beautiful. Don't go for second best. And young gay guys don't acknowledge it. It's so aggravating. Then you know your love is real. Express yourself. You've got to make it. Express yourself. Hey, 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 hey. So if you want it right now, make it show you how. Express what it's got. Oh, baby, ready or not. Madonna. Grabbing her pussy. Wow. What you need is a That's amazing. He will regret it. <laughs> that thrust. Himself. Hey, 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 hey. So if you want it right now, make it show you how. Express what it's got. Oh, baby, ready or not, express yourself. Her body movements express are so amazing. Hey, hey. So Especially right for the time. Now, wow. Express what it's got. Oh, baby, baby, ready or not. not. Oh my god, I'm going deaf. <laughs> wow. Express yourself. Aww. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That was so cute. Everything you want is right here. Oh my god, I don't want Pothead Peter Jackson or Percy Jackson, whatever the fuck this is. What is this? Oh, it's a Hulu ad. Go fa la la fuck yourself. That's fine. We're gonna give Madonna that ad revenue. We're not gonna skip it. I'll watch. I'll watch Pothead Peter Percy Jackson or whatever the fuck Hulu this ad is. Guys, I am a mess. Every time I I speak, unless I'm just saying, "Wow, oh my god," something outrageously ridiculous is coming out of my mouth. It. I don't know what I've evolved into. It's become something otherworldly. Regardless, I love you. Have Madonna Monday. Check out that entire Madonna Monday playlist. It has been such a wild, chaotic. But also kind of eclectic, electric, and full of smiles, laughter, and tears. Journey. I love Madonna. She is the end of discussion. Greatest artist of all time. And guys, really sad. Yesterday or today, her brother passed away. And I wanted to see if there was anything with her brother. Let me see. Let me look it up. Madonna. Because if so, we will react to it. And brother. Is there something with her, with her brother? Maybe there is. And before anyone says anything, we are going to react to some clips involving Christopher Ciccone, uh and his passing and a ton of Madonna-related stuff. But I think I want to make a video dedicated directly to that. I'm not going to do it next week because I know that, yikes, uh, I've already pushed off the Katy Perry thing that I mentioned. Or maybe that's a bonus clip. I don't know if I mentioned it. Katy Perry is saying that basically she doesn't do what she does today at 40 years old if it was not for Madonna. And guys, that is true. So I'm going to react to some Katy Perry and Madonna performances. Although, I don't know if that's coming next week. 
regardless, I will dedicate an entire video to Madonna's brother, Christopher, and react to a ton of stuff at the two of them over the years. And I think there's still a few more clips. Lots of stuff. I love you. Um, I don't know what the fuck I, I just filmed, but I love you very much. Yeah, he died at age 63 with his battle with cancer. Very fucking sad, man. Madonna's brother, Christopher, died at 63. Very sad. Just want to honor him. Christopher, the younger brother of Madonna, passed away of cancer October 4th. Oh, it wasn't today? One of eight siblings, Christopher began his career as Madonna's assistant dresser. The two had their past struggles with Christopher writing an all-tell book published in 2008 about his relationship with his sister, leading to a fallout. Oh my god. How did I not know anything about this? Their relationship appeared to be better terms by... Motherfucker. Who can read that fast? Not me. Their relationship appeared to be on better terms by 2012, according to an interview with Evening Standard. His death comes less than two weeks after their stepmother... Oh my god, Joan... Died on September 24th after a brief encounter with a very aggressive cancer. As someone that has brain cancer, I know it's a fucking beast. That's so sad, dude. That's heartbreaking. That is absolutely heartbreaking. She you know what nobody up. talks about when it comes oh, to building a content Do you group? know what nobody talks about? Why the fuck you're speaking to me? That's what nobody says. Why are you popping up on my screen? But guys, I don't skip the ads. If it's somewhere that's giving me content that I'm going to enjoy, or, or or like a Madonna YouTube, I'm not going to skip it. Is speaking out over we'll the let death the ad play. of her brother. After news broke that the pop queen's younger brother, Christopher Ciccone, one of her seven siblings, died at the age of 63, Madonna takes to social media to share a tribute for her younger brother. Writing on Instagram alongside photos of the two, my brother Christopher is gone. He was the closest human to me for so long. It's hard to explain our bond, but it grew out of an understanding that we were different and society was going to give us a hard time for not following the status quo. She That's continues, so we took each other's hands and we danced through the madness of our childhood. In fact, dance was a kind of super glue that held us together. Discovering dance in our small Midwestern town saved me <laughs> and then my brother came along and it saved him too. Going on to detail her bond and share. Yeah, I heard her, with her brother, brother died. Madonna adds, my with brother family was and right husband. by my side. He was a painter, a poet, and a visionary. By his side. I admired him. So sad. He had impeccable taste and a sharp tongue. He's which cute. He sometimes used against me, but I always forgave him. We soared the highest which is heights together used against and floundered me. in <laughs> the lowest That's lows. That's siblings, right? Somehow, we always found each other again, wow. and we held hands and we kept dancing. And while the two, quote, did not speak for some time over the last few years, when she found out Christopher was sick, Madonna adds, quote, we found our way back to each other. She ends her post with, there will never be anyone like him. I know he's dancing somewhere. On October 4th, a rep told People Magazine that Christopher died of cancer, adding that he passed away, quote, peacefully with his husband Ray Thacker by his side. E! News has reached out to Christopher's rep for comment, but has not yet heard back. Christopher was 63 years old. So sad, man. Rest in peace. I love that she said, I know he's somewhere. I love that she said, I know he's somewhere dancing. Th that is so beautiful. Guys, but happy Madonna Monday. Not to be get all sad and emotional. This will probably be a bonus clip because I did not want to be all sad and emotional. But I also wanted the video not to be just 11 fucking minutes. Especially because my dumbass missed last week's Madonna Monday. Shame, shame, sham, and sloppy slut gay fag bitch. And hooker a bitch that I am. I don't know what I just said, but honestly, I'm very, I am very sad. I love you. I appreciate you. Happy been done to Monday. Please make sure that you are subscribed to your bitch and that you follow her on Twitch. I love you. I appreciate you. And I'll see you all next week. Hopefully I can get the Katy Perry video edited. Like I said, guys, look how many hours I worked this last week. Wow. It's really been hard. <laughs> but, uh.
I have to. I gotta, I gotta work my ass off. I have so much debt. It's not like it was when I was 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, uh, and I was able to just do streaming and stuff like that to survive. I really gotta work my, my puss, my pussy off now, and you know what? I'll work my pussy off with a smile. I love you. Ha! What a, what a messy slut I am. I love you guys. Oh, and check out the vlo little vlog I uploaded yesterday. It's a very fun one. Please check it out. It's very fun. It, I mean, it may not be very fun, but 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 it, it's cute. It's a cute video. I love you guys. Happy Madonna Monday. I, I just wanted to get Roy on the screen because as I was sitting here getting ready to film this Madonna Monday, Roy just subscribed. Roy B. Wow. Talk about giving me a wet ass pussy. I don't know what that was. I thought I could rhyme the letter B with pussy because I am a child and I'm not cognitively a functioning person. Guys, I'm still in need of a haircut. If you watched yesterday's video, I talked about that for a bit. It's still there. Oh, look at that. Oh my God, my webcam freezes. I need a fucking new webcam so badly or like a new computer or something. Or like God, maybe just a mixture of all three. Fuck me, I'm weird. What is this intro? This is not an intro. This is a bonus clip. <laughs> and and I reacted last week. I, I I would have been last week had I got the video up to Katy Perry saying that like literally I'm 40 years old. I would not be able to do what I'm doing today if it was not for Madonna. And even though I do think Katy Perry is a dumb whore, um, because I do love Kesha Rose Siebert, my favorite living legend. And I, guys, I don't actually think Katy Perry is a dumb whore. I just. I'm just like, you are a kind of a gross bitch. And I and that'll be a whole video that I will talk about at some point. Dumbass, dumbass bitch. Love Katy Perry. I have her album signed. I, I, I said the only way I'm going to buy this album is if it's signed. I've never listened to the album. Still to this day, I've not listened to it. I'm going to do a full reaction to it one day. I didn't watch the last music video that I missed. I'm going to react to both of those. Because as you can see, I have reacted to quite a few of her new era shit. But but I'm not I'm not ready to dive full, fully deep in the journey of Katy Perry until until I'm able to get myself in that mindset live at the MTV 1989 MTV Awards. I really don't know anything about MTV. Isn't it so weird how MTV used to be like such a big like the mu uh, music whatever the fuck what is what does MTV stand for music television videography. MTV, music and TV. What does it stand for? That's all going to be bonus clips. Guys, I don't know what MTV stands for. I'm dumb as fuck. That is so embarrassing. I don't even know if that what one. What do you think? I got to take an allergy pill. <laughs> I need to make that a bonus clip. I don't want people to think I'm a nasty, unprofessional cunt. Because they do. They do think that. <laughs> and most of the time, it's true. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to subscribe and follow your bitch on Twitch. I am trying so hard not to be such a messy cunt. Or to be a little more appropriate, I'm trying very hard not to be a messy madam. And please make sure you subscribe. And like I said, follow your bitch on Twitch. And also, please leave a comment. I respond to every single comment. Or at least I do my best to respond to every single comment. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. And I will see you very, very soon. Love you.